Hey guys, I hope you're enjoying this video. I just popped in to say, make sure you head on over to freedomapparel.com. I have t-shirts, protect your energy t-shirts, it's the melanin t-shirts, and my Freedom Apparel logo t-shirts and many more. I also have fanny packs and I also have masks to match the t-shirts. If you find anything interesting, the link will be in the description box below. So let's get right back into the video. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to talk about De'Ara and Ken. Ken was spotted out with another woman. Not well, not with another woman, with a new woman. Um, that And people was trying to claim that that's his new, the new chick or whatever. whatever. Um, and I'm going to talk about De'Ara because people just are implying that she responded to the situation without responding. So let's get into the video. First of all, I think this video is weird. I think, you know, to film people and to have the side piece video in the in the background as if like this woman is a side chick and all this different type of stuff. Like clearly they're not together anymore, so I don't know how this woman would even be a side chick. And then the thing says, uh, Ken is out with with this B word, um, and saying it don't get no better than De'Ara. What I really want supporters to do, and people in general, just stop looking at the outside of a person and trying to discern her just because she she dressed nice and she looked this way, it ain't no better than this. Like, y'all need to really start thinking about how somebody mind works, how do, how do this person treat people, like all this different type of stuff that it's more than just the way somebody appeared to be. And I, and this is no shot at the error. I'm just saying in general, you don't, it's more than just, than just looks. So I always feel like when, when people go and compare, oh, he ain't as cute or she ain't as cute or she don't dress as nice. This person don't have that much swag, et cetera, et cetera. It don't have, it's not all about just that. So I really want people to open their minds um, when it comes to that. And I also think this is just weird. Like this woman could be a business partner. They could be having a business meeting or they could just be regular friends, whatever. Like who, like nobody knows who this woman is, where she come from, what she do, none of that. So to just imply that, like it just dumb. It didn't. It don't. It didn't really make no sense to me. Um, I don't think this type of stuff would ever make any sense to me to film somebody while they out eating, and I guess just to go viral. We are in a time period where people are looking for something to go viral. I seen people, even with their young dog situation, filming the police is doing all these different type of stuff. The kids was even out filming. Um, when they was removing a car from a backyard or something like that, like everybody want content to just go viral. So I like, I just don't know, and I feel like it's the same thing with trolling. Like, do people say things to famous folks so they can like it or respond and be mad at them so they can say, "Girl, guess who got mad at me?" Or "Do guess who got mad at me?" Like, what? I don't know. I don't understand it. I think this is just as weird as this when people are saying oh that blue shoe in that picture i think that's ken shoe this is ken shoe but the shoes don't even look they not even the same shoe and then um you know even in diara's video they was like oh she did this on uh accident she didn't know this was in her video hey guys i hope you're enjoying this video i just popped in to say to head on over to freedom .com. we got our new hoodies out now it's about to get cold outside so go ahead and grab your hoodie we also have t-shirts it's the melanin t-shirts freedom logo pearl t-shirts i have my ancestor t-shirts so if you see something you like head on over to freedom .com. now let's get back to the video i don't know how people are thinking these days but to think that she didn't realize that a a foot was in her video and she made a mistake. Like, come on now. The girl been editing videos for years. I think she know when there was a foot left in her shoe. But to go do investigation to try to figure out whose shoe is that? Whose shoe? Whose shoe? I seen several videos on the fact that there was a shoe in her video. I'm like, this, like, is this a time? Like, have we come to this point in life to where people 
have to take the smallest things and make it so big? Like what? People was really investigating, trying to figure out who shoot it that belonged to. Is that Ken? I even saw videos uh, of them saying that she was in the same car with Ken. And it was like, uh, this is the car that Ken got now. And it looks like from this picture, she's in the driver. I mean, she's in the passenger seat. I'm just like, this is what happens when people keep their personal life private like Ken and De'Ara does. And all people can do is make videos speculating things. And you and you're never giving any, you know, they're never coming out and saying nothing. Like this is the reason why. Because if you do come out and say something, the people are gonna take that and run with it and, and expand it longer than it needs to be. But in their case, they don't say nothing and they still be um in the in the blocks every other week, especially the air. Like, come on now. This is just odd. So, um, Diara took to Twitter and she was just tweeting. She just said fake love, you can keep it. This is what make her happy. Um and then she RT'd a tweet that said call me Diara cuz I'm not saying nothing about what's going on in my life and I ain't clearing up nothing. To me personally, like she had nothing to clear up. Like I don't know how they took these tweets and tried to make it seem like She's talking about the situation with Ken, even though these tweets came out after um, he was exposed on the internet. My thing is she had nothing to clear up. She had nothing to talk about because that's not her business anymore. He moved on. She moved on. Like when she was, well, I ain't gonna say, I don't know if she moved on. I don't know if he moved on. But um, when she was alleged with, with that uh, that other woman, because I don't know why people call her st- a stud, because that's, I don't know. I think that could be a little disrespectful. But when she was with that other woman, you know what I'm saying? Like, what's the big deal? Who who cares? Let them people do whatever they do. I honestly do not believe any of these tweets had anything to do with whatever Ken did. It's just something she said because she always say, um, well, I've heard her say several times that she's not clearing up nothing or speaking on nothing. And we can see that by their actions. The last video when Ken cheated, the very first time, and they put out that whole, this is what happened, did a whole YouTube about it. That was the last time, the first and last time they actually even spoke on anything. And they learned their lesson from that. And ever since then, it's all speculation. We just assumed this is what happened, this, 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 this. Like, it's it's let them people live their life. And when I was looking for something on Twitter, I came across this tweet. I came across this tweet from 2017 well, she said every time someone tweets something, doesn't mean they're talking about a specific person. That's just how they feel. We agree. Like, literally, I don't think whatever she, whatever she tweeted had anything to do with Ken. And I just think it's weird that people are, like, hiding and filming somebody while they out just enjoying their dinner. Like, that's, now that's, that's weird. That's weird to me. I'm, I'm. I'm never going out and saying, oh, my God, y'all drink at the table. Let me film it and put it on. Like, why? He's eating. He's human. He's supposed to be eating. Like, come on now. What, what's so amazing about somebody eating? Like, it, and it be tripping me out. Like, when they see fa- famous people eating spaghetti. You eat spaghetti? Well, what else you think they eat? Like, I don't, I don't get it. But, I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this whole situation down in the comments. Like, do y'all think that supporters and media and blogs and stuff be taking these situations way too far and way out of proportion? Um, or it, do y'all think something different? Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments, and I'm out.